This is a tutorial video on how to find your student's assessment level. There are two ways to find out your student's level. One, you can determine your student's level according to their method books. And another method to find out their level is to simply log into Einstein and check which assessments your students have taken and passed. Now it's important that you check that they've also passed the assessment. You do have the option to retake that last assessment for those levels that you did not pass previously. But first, let's learn how we can determine our student's level through their method books. Into Einstein. You can go to our website, musicpillars.com, and click on Parent Resources, where you can find the option to log in Pillars Einstein. Click on that option, and it will take you to the page that has tutorial videos on how to use Einstein and how to add practice time to the assessment sheet or assignment sheet. There's two ways to log into Einstein. Either way, you can check the student's assessment level. If you have logged in as a parent before and you remember your password, you can go ahead and click on that option and go under Guardian Login. Here you will simply enter the email that you have used as well as the password that you have set when you first received an invitation to our Einstein website. You can also sign in with Google Plus if you used a Google email. Another option to log into Einstein would be through our student login. In this case, you would then just click on the box that says student login. Make sure that the location is Forest Ranch and then scroll down to the option where it says Student Login. You may log in as a student by putting in your username, which is actually going to be a fake email that is made by your first name dot last name at musicpillars.com. In this case, I'm going to pretend that MP is the first name dot kid as the last name at musicpillars.com and everyone's password will be pillars1234. Click login via email and this will lead you to the student desktop. From here you can see your current level. You can also see how you did in the other assessments. In this case I see that I didn't pass the level 4 theory exam which means that I may want to challenge myself to retake the level 4 exam so that I can score higher and pass it this time around. And then I can also choose to also take level 5 exam to see if I can then be passing that or at least approaching the current level expectations. And that's how you can check your student's assessment level.